everybody. My name is Elias Bowles and I'm a second year graphic design major here at RIT. Today I'll be sharing with you what attending an RIT men's hockey home game is like. The RIT men's hockey team plays in the NCAA Division I, which is the highest division possible. RIT plays its home games at the Gene Polizeni Center, which can hold up to 4,300 fans at once. There are multiple concession stands around the Gene Polizeni Center, as well as the Tigers team store, where you can pick up some cool RIT hockey merchandise. Hockey is a big deal to a lot of RIT students, which is evident based on the crowd reactions throughout the night. One of the highlights of every home game is the RIT Corner Crew. The Corner Crew is a dedicated group of RIT staff, students, alumni, and dedicated locals who support RIT men's and women's hockey. The corner crew has a number of specific chants for things that might happen during the game. For example, after the Tigers score a goal, the corner crew will point at the opposing goalie and start chanting, it's all your fault. During the game, I was attending the RIT goalie got hit kind of hard and was sort of shaken a little bit. And he was a little bit slow to get up, but once he got on his feet, the crowd started chanting, sexy goalie. Another form of RIT spirit at the game is the RIT Pet Band, which is a group of student musicians from all academic fields. One of my absolute favorite things that the Pet Band does is they'll play the Star Wars like Imperial March when the referees are skating onto the ice rink. When the pep band isn't playing, they'll join in on chants and help rally the crowd. <laughs> Richie is also at all the RIT hockey games, so feel free to go up to him and say hi. You might also find yourself on the Jumbotron, like I did. I'd like to think that I was the reason they put my area up on the Jumbotron, but like there was some cute kid or something like that who was dancing or something. But hey, I still got on the Jumbotron. RIT was up by one point with less than a minute left. So the opposing team swapped out their goalie for an extra attacker so that they have a better chance of scoring and tying up the game. However, that backfired since RIT ended up scoring from the other side of the ring, making it 3-1 and sealing an RIT victory. After all the players from both teams shook hands, the entire RIT team rammed into the glass right by their corner crew in celebration of the victory over Sacred Heart. And to end it off, the corner crew led a chant of war in first place. Overall, the RIT hockey game experience is so much fun. And it fills you with so much Tiger spirit that your veins are going to be running RIT orange, I swear. I hope you enjoyed this video and I hope to see you at a home hockey game. Go Tigers!